Hello friends and welcome to another tutorial on Geeks for Geeks. In this video, we are going to understand the program which counts consonants in a string. First, let us take an example. For input A, B, C, D, E, the output will be 3 as there are 3 consonants B, C and D. For input Geeks for Geeks portal, the output will be 12. Next, let us see the algorithm. We take a sample string a, b, c, d, e and pass it to total consonants function. So, str will be a, b, c, d, e. Next, we take a count variable initialized to 0 to store the number of consonants. Now, we run a for loop from 0 to str.length and check character at ith index is a consonant or not. So first i will be 0. str at 0 is a, so we pass a to is consonant function. We convert it to uppercase for simplicity. Next we check if it is a vowel and it lies in the ASCII range of upper alphabets which is 65 to 90. as both are true, we return true, that is not true, that is false to the caller function. The if statement does not get satisfied and now i becomes 1. str at index 1 is b, so we pass b to is consonant function and convert it to uppercase. Since b is not a vowel, we get a false in vowel checking part. Since there is an AND AND operator, we will get false and we return NOT to false that is true to the caller function. The IF condition gets satisfied and we increment COUNT. So COUNT becomes 1. The same happens with character at index 2 that is C. Now I becomes 3. Character at index 3 is a space which does not lie in the ASCII range of alphabets. So we return false and count remains true. Then i will be 4 and character at index 4 which is d a consonant. So we return true and increment count. Then i will be 5. Character at index 5 is e which is a vowel. So we return false. We have iterated in the for loop and we return count which is 3 and this is the total number of consonants in the string str. With this, we come to an end of this tutorial. For any doubts or suggestions, please leave them in the comment section below. Thank you for watching.